Hello everybody, Aiden here, aka Mr Vlog. Now, I put up a post on the Watford Ladies Fan Group Facebook page to put in questions so I can answer for you here today. Now, I was meant to do this video quite a while ago, but I kind of put it off for a bit to get enough questions. And I believe I have enough today. Uh, first question, favourite Watford player and why? My favourite Watford player is Emma Beckett. Because every single time we need something on the pitch, it comes through her. Every single time we need a fantastic goal to be scored, 9 times out of 10, it comes through her with her free kicks. And yeah, she's just the life of the team for me. Because we uh, adapted the style from playing out from the back and she's so calm on the ball and she can whip the ball over the top of everyone to get in behind the defence. Uh, second question was, what's the best part of a ladies match day? The best part is walking up to the stadium, already feeling the energy before the game's even kicked off, seeing everyone, smiles on their faces, knowing one way or the other we're going to see a good game of football. Third question was, how could I improve the match day experience, get better speakers down at Kings Langley. Question number four is a very good one. It's kind of three questions in one. What was your first ladies game? What made you go? And what made you come back? Now, my first ladies game, I believe, was Brighton at home in a pre-season friendly. Um, and, yeah, it was just a very good game. So exciting. The... Match was going back and forwards uh, from both ends, and it was such a good experience to see players go out there and wanting to prove themselves, prove that the ladies' game is worth watching even more than the men. And yeah, it just dragged me in. Then, of course, we've created a community aspect around it. And the community just makes you want to go even more. Because if your friends are there, you're going to enjoy the match day even more. And yeah, it's just a great experience all around. Now, fifth question. Best moment supporting the girls. It has to be Plymouth away. What an absolute fantastic match it was. So worth getting up really early in the morning. And the noise that we made down there, the match itself, there were drama, there were fantastic goals. So much emotion went into that match and what an important match it was. And yeah, like I said, Plymouth away, fantastic. Number six, you're the gaffer, everyone is fit, name your team. Now, I can't really say because the team Clint puts out every single week is the team that I would pick and you can't fault him for, for that because he knows exactly what he wants out of a team no matter whether you're on the substitute bench or if you're starting the game he knows exactly what you want and yeah can't get any better than that really if you could sign one player for Watford Ladies, who would it be and why? Now, I know it's probably never going to happen, but you have to shout a big name out there. I would go for Ellen White. She's a complete forward who I reckon partnered alongside Helen Ward would rip teams apart limb from limb. And it's not saying Leggy doesn't do a good job because she does a fantastic job as well. But I reckon the partnership between Helen Ward and Ellen White would just be unstoppable. No question about it. Now, I left this question till last because it is an important one. And it is a serious one in ways. I know it was thrown out there as a joke. But serious at the same time. If we would raise £200 for charity, would you be the mascot for the next game? Answer, yes, I would. 
200 pounds I will be the mascot for as long as you want me to be uh, let's set another target out there if we raise 500 pound for a charity I will be the mascot for the whole entire day if I'm allowed and anything on top of that fantastic but the answer completely yes I would and when the season gets up and going again we will we will sort something out sorry for my little start there <laughs> but yeah that's all the questions I have I picked the best ones that I could to get this video out for you today hopefully it put a smile on your face and hopefully Watford fans and loads of other sporting fans out there hope you're staying safe during this pandemic and yeah just can't wait to see when the new season starts come on you horns